KS Institute of Technology and uh, it's an ex an accredited institute and uh, uh, it has got a de decent placement you know and it's based out of Bangalore on Kanakpura road premier institution based on the atel ranking or the government of india they call aria or aria ranking where they have been you know placed uh, as ranked whereas one of the institution started in 1999 so it's already 22 years this college uh, is in uh, action and uh, these are few of the pictures which i'm uh, are currently showing you know these are some of the pictures taken from the classroom perspective and the other infrastructure facilities which is lush green 2025 acres campus which is in outskirts of bangalore this is the library uh, infrastructure right so uh, you know cyber competitions like like tycothon right so this is one of those picture and then for a good you know infrastructure for hostels for staying you know students right so they have a couple of hostels for boys and uh, then also the hostels are available for girls so this is one of the pictures for that uh, girls hostel and also for the students who are out in bangalore right and they want to travel from their home and you know so these are the bus transportation facilities also available part of this college infrastructure so that's other parts you know like in campus life you have a sports facilities and you have got the cricket football basketball volleyball and many other outdoor games apart from that there are you know indoor games also there and uh, this is the their annual fest a yearly annual fest called ananya to and, and this is one of the picture of that and also that's basically uh, students you know uh, you know get a good opportunity to uh, apart from academic part to excel in you know their their activities or the fun moments right so so overall this college is a decent college is a department so computer science two parts computer science and science and engineering and design and then artificial intelligence is a new branch which is getting introduced in this year it's so ai was not if your rank is between 20000 to 40000 for computer science and up to 50000 for electronics take this branch and coming to the fee structure so a lot of students ask me so 98000 put together is a fee for your general quota 65000 plus added college charges and for comet k it is 177000 for aiml and cs branches companies so infosys tcs entity mfss cgi wine tree kpmg IBM and a few of you know multinational like IBM just pay amazon so all of them some of them are you know a decent size in you know, a bulk recruiters from this college similar to uh, what they do from many other colleges in bangalore and some of them are the you know uh, selective pickers so i'm now going to cover the placement in details right so this is for a 2022 batch total placements are 645 offers for kres group of institution so there are two colleges ksit and ksecm right so for the ksit around 300 plus placements have happened this year and the rest 300 placements are for ks school of engineering and management that is kssem so this figure is put together of two colleges now i will cover specifically for ksit which is this video what are the students which are got placed so if you see uh, all good companies visit and they take in good numbers so this is accenture so around 20 plus students you see being 25 students at least get got placed in accenture uh, which is a quite decent select now if you move further there then you see garuda aerospace for aeronautics for uh, uh, students and at around 10 students uh, mindtree around 5 students infosys around 5 student sap 1 student and verzio 1 student so which is good now if you move further you see virtuosa two students uh, you have another uh, hash team which is delight company one student uh, you have cerner and small small companies one student but all of these are the multinational companies and uh, provides a great opportunity for the students moving further now it is tcs right so tcs has got a good number of selections there around 30 students you can see at least 30 30 to 35 students and uh, which is a good uh, you know placements now you move further so zaro education around 8 to 10 students and uh, uh, you know ibm around 5 to uh, 4 to 5 students and then kpmg on the last row you see around 7 to 8 students so all of these are very good company and the good pay masters and part of kssit now if i further move you have a first information sciences which is very good company around 6 to 7 students you have a kinox around 6 to 7 students and in the last row you see wipro around 6 uh, students now if you further move you have capgemini there's a row at the center around 8 to 10 students lido is also in many campuses around 4 to 5 students and then you have a pial and you have avali some four to so total 20 25 students on this sheet and further good companies like ntt data which is a global japanese company and you see around 25 students uh, getting placed in that so which is also a quite good placement then you further move this is the second sheet for ntt another 25 students so assuming 40 to 50 students get placed in ntt data ntt data which is a global mnc now if you see the infosys another big selection so you see around minimum you know 30 to 30 plus students getting placed in infosys and that is also good you know applicable as a good placement 
so overall 300 plus students and hope you like this uh, video please do uh, you know comment if you have any other questions but you know please subscribe to this channel i will i'm going to review almost uh, all good colleges in karnataka which including bangalore like this